Wow, uh, 25 years, I, I can hardly believe it. It doesn't seem like that long. Um, for eight years of my life, I gave everything I had to the X-Files, and it was in the hope at the time that this would not be television that was just consumed and disposed, but rather television that would stand the test of time. So for people to still be talking about the show and celebrating it 25 years later is really a dream come true. And the feeling I'm left with is really, more than anything, gratitude. Um, gratitude for the opportunity, gratitude to the amazing cast, starting with David, Jillian, Mitch, Robert, Annabeth, Bill, Dean, Bruce, Tom, Nick, Jerry, Stephen, Lori, the late John Neville, and so many others. Um, the incredible directors, the late Ken Manners, Rob Bowman, so many others. Uh, the fantastic producers, Bob and Michelle, and my comrades in arms and the writing staff, Vince and John, all the amazing first season writers who really define the show, Glenn and Jim and Howard and Alex, uh, of course, Darren Morgan, uh, and last but certainly not least, Chris Carter, who not only had the genius to create this show, but really inspired and insisted that everyone on it did their best work. Scully, Dana Scully. Our crews, who really became like our families, uh, both in Vancouver and in Los Angeles, on the TV series and on the feature films. Um, their level of artistry really made the show what it was. And finally, I have to say, I am amazed and impressed by the fans of this show, who have not only stood with it for 25 years, but brought along new generations of fans and found incredibly imaginative ways to keep the show alive and to use the show to benefit real world causes. That's incredibly inspiring, and I, and I think we're all humbled and flattered by the fans the show has attracted. So um, thank you to everyone, and, uh, and I, I'm very, very pleased to be celebrating this anniversary.